Hello and welcome to another episode of today's GK. Let's begin with a practice question. With reference to the refugees in India, consider the following statements. In India, the state governments have no powers to grant refugee status to any foreigner. India is not a member of the United Nations Refugees Convention of 1951. So we have to select the correct statement. Both are correct. C is the correct answer. The state governments have no powers to grant refugee status to any foreigner. And India is not a signatory to the United Nations Refugee Convention of 1951 and its 1967 protocol. It is a United Nations multilateral treaty that defines who is a refugee and sets out the rights of individuals who are granted asylum and the responsibilities of nation that grant asylum. It also sets out which people do not qualify as refugees such as war criminals. Consider the following statements. Article 170 deals with the constitution of state legislative assemblies. There is no provision in the constitution for a joint sitting of the state legislature and Bihar, Maharashtra and West Bengal have a bicameral legislature. We have to select the correct statement. Only the second is correct, B is the correct answer. Recently, the election results of five states, namely Uttar Pradesh, Punjab, Uttarakhand, Goa, Manipur were announced. Chapter 3 of Part 6 of the Constitution is concerned with state legislatures. Article 170 deals with the composition of legislative assemblies and there is no provision in the Constitution for a joint sitting of the state legislature. The states having bicameral legislatures are Bihar, Maharashtra, Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana and Uttar Pradesh. The state of Punjab and West Bengal abolished the second chambers in 1969 and 1970 respectively. Consider the following statements. Nuclear power has no greenhouse gases or air pollutants. Nuclear energy is a renewable energy source. Joint ventures of public sector companies can set up nuclear power projects. We have to select the correct statement. C is the correct option. The Kundakulam village panchayat has passed a resolution against setting up away from reactor facility at the Kundakulam nuclear power project. Nuclear energy comes from splitting atoms in a reactor to heat water into steam, turn a turbine and generate electricity and nuclear power is a zero emission power. It has no greenhouse gases or air pollutants and the Atomic Energy Act of 1962 was amended to enable joint ventures of public sector companies to set up nuclear power projects. Nuclear energy is usually considered another non-renewable energy source. Consider the following statements. Inflation is indicative of the increase in the purchasing power of a unit of country's currency. Inflation could ultimately lead to a deacceleration in the economic growth. Consumer Price Index is released by the National Statistical Office. We have to select the correct statement. Second and third are correct. D is the correct option. India's retail inflation may average below 6% even if crude oil prices average $100 a barrel. In 2022-23, rising prices, however, remain an elevated risk to growth, especially as private consumption remains subdued. Inflation refers to the rise in the price of most goods and services of daily or common use, such as food, clothing, housing, recreation, transport, consumer staples, etc. Inflation measures the average price change in a basket of commodities and services over the time. Inflation is indicative of a decree of the decrease in the purchasing power of a unit of country's currency and this could ultimately lead to the acceleration in economic growth. However, a moderate level of inflation is required in the economy to ensure that production is promoted and in India, inflation is primarily measured by two main indices, namely wholesale price index and consumer price index. Consumer price index is released by the National Statistical Office. Consider the following statements. Minimum support price is the minimum price that the sugar mills have to pay to the farmers. India is the second largest producer of sugar after China. Rangarajan committee was set up to give recommendations on regulation of the sugar industry. We have to select the correct statement. Only the third statement is correct. D is the correct answer. Indian sugar mills signed contracts to export 550,000 tons of the sweetener as surging global prices and a weak rupee made overseas sales lucrative. FRP, that is fair and remunerative price, is the minimum price that the sugar mills have to pay to the farmers and India is the second largest producer of sugar after Brazil and China stands at third position. Rangarajan Committee 
was set up to give recommendations on regulation of the sugar industry consider the following statements lunar craters are bowl shaped landforms created by volcanism the largest crater on the moon is called the south pole aitken basin we have to select the correct statement both are correct c is the correct answer a leftover piece of the spacecraft flying through space reportedly hit the surface of the moon recently creating a new crater that may be around 65 feet wide lunar craters are bowl shaped landforms created by volcanism and cratering there are hundreds of thousands of moon craters ranging from less than a mile across to giant basins and the largest crater on the moon is called the south pole aitken basin moon's lack of water atmosphere and tectonic plates there is little erosion and craters are found that exceed 2 billion years in age consider the following statements with respect to a party's eligibility to be recognized as a national party it needs to win at least 2% of the total seats in the lok sabha from at least 3 different states or it should be recognized as a state party in four or more states we have to select the correct statement both are correct c is the correct answer the aam aadmi party is the only big winner apart from the bjp in this election and now it aspires to become a national party for a party to be recognized as a national party it needs to meet one of the three criteria it needs to win at least 2% of the total seats in the lok sabha from at least three different states get at least 6% votes in four states in addition to four lok sabha seats or be recognized as a state party in four or more states consider the following statements with respect to xeno transplantation xeno transplantation involving the kidney was first tried in humans in the 1980s alpha gal in the pig's heart can elicit a positive immune response in humans that is why it is kept intact for xeno transplantation we have to select the correct statement both are not correct d is the correct answer a patient who's failing heart had been replaced with the heart of a genetically altered pig in a landmark surgery in the united states died 2 months after the operation according to the fda xeno transplantation is any procedure that involves the transplantation implantation or infusion into a human recipient of either live cells tissues or organs from a non human animal source human body fluids cells tissues or organs that have had ex vivo contact with live non human animal cell tissues or organ xeno transplantation involving the heart not the kidney was first tried in humans in 1980s and in the case of bennett the donor pig had been put through 10 genetic modification it was intended to deactivate or knock out four pig genes and add six human genes and a gall safe pig was used from which a gene that codes for alpha gall was removed alpha gall can elicit a devastating immune response in humans and gall safe pigs have been well studied and are approved by the US FDA for use in pharmacology consider the following statements with respect to the international day of women judges march 10 marks the international day of women judges on this day the united nations reaffirmed its commitment to develop and implement effective strategies for the advancement of women in the judicial system the resolution of the general assembly was drafted by the state of qatar we have to select the correct statement all are correct d is the correct answer the cgi addressed an online event to mark the first ever international day of women judges march 10 marks the international day of women judges on this day the un reaffirms its commitment to develop and implement appropriate and effective strategies for the advancement of women in the judicial system the resolution of the general assembly was drafted by the state of qatar which is proof to bring a positive shift in the society consider the following statements with respect to mount merapi volcano it is an active shield volcano it is situated in indonesia we have to select the correct statement second is correct b is the correct answer mount merapi volcano spewed avalanches of hot clouds and eruptions overnight forcing about 250 residents to flee to temporary shelters mount merapi gunung merapi means fire mountain it is an active strato volcano located on the border between province of central java and the special region of yogyakarta indonesia it is the most active volcano in indonesia and has erupted regularly since 1548 the endurance recently seen in the news refers to which of the following the correct answer to this question is option a a ship the wreckage of polar explorer ernest shackleton's ship Endurance has been found. A team searching for it said on Wednesday, and it was crushed by Antarctic ice and sank some ten thousand feet to the ocean floor. 
more than a century ago. The three-masted sailing ship was lost in November 1915 during Shackleton's failed attempt to make the first land crossing of Antarctica. Let's look at the practice question for the next segment. Consider the following states. Chhattisgarh, Jharkhand, Odisha, Madhya Pradesh. What is the correct order of the above states with respect to the total coal reserves? So, answer it correctly. That's it for today. Tomorrow, we shall meet again with another segment.